Governor Kathy Hochul is supporting legislation that would change New York's accounting standards for greenhouse gas emissions. Our New York Capital correspondent Elise Klein hears from lawmakers and environmental advocates. While the state budget continues to progress into overtime with an extender, a change to a New York climate law arises in negotiations. Recently introduced legislation supported by Governor Hochul intends to change New York's accounting standards for greenhouse gas emissions from 20 years to 100 years. This change amends New York's Climate Leadership and Community Protection Act, or the CLCPA, a 2019 law that requires New York to reduce its greenhouse gas emissions 40% by 2030 and 85% by 2050 from 1990 levels. Some advocates say this proposal will harm frontline communities. What they, what I know for sure, I want my kids to survive. And being in the front line, there is no way that we could survive because my, I don't got income or the means of an income when a hurricane comes for me to uproot my family and go. Some Democratic lawmakers agree this proposal will have negative impacts. And to have this be part of the negotiations last minute is a grave disappointment. And it is very scary for a lot of us. This bill will, in effect, gut the CLCPA. Some Republican lawmakers welcome this change, saying it will help address affordability. The New York State Energy Research and Development Authority says they are working on solutions to address the state's climate change goals and issues of affordability. When, when we think about how we get from here to there, what we have learned over a series of years and certainly what the global community would agree with is it is possible to do both. In Albany, Elise Klein, WNY News Now.